Hey, this is Steven from the Legit PC, and welcome to a uh, first look at Dead Rising 3 Apocalypse Edition. Uh, so this is the day one, sorry, not first look, it's day one. Uh, game so far is kind of buggy. It's very difficult to get it to go into full screen. Basically what happens is every time I brought it up, it only goes into like the bottom right hand corner of the screen. So what I have to do is when I hit to maximize the game, I have to click on something else at the same time, and then everything pops up all cluttered, then I have to close everything out and click on it. So right now it seems to be doing okay. I have uh, um, also, you kind of see uh, other problems like my on-screen display isn't working. It's been a long time since my on-screen display hasn't been working. So uh, that's also another thing, but at least um, the shadow play uh, FPS draw is working. So you guys could at least see some of the performance, but I think it's going to be using uh, quite a bit of optimization, uh, quite a bit of the card. As I've heard, it's not the best port in the world. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and look at the options. Uh, very, very simple stuff. I don't want to change this because, like I said, it'll break the game, and then I have to go through all the crap to get it fixed. So let's not do that. All right, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and set it on full. We're going to so game. This is a level of detail bar, so it's. It's just a relative one. You go all the way out to do everything, uh, all the way up. Ambient occlusion on. Um, let's do. You see it changing there in the background. Let's do. Uh, there's no TXAA. Let's do FXAA. On on high. It doesn't go any higher than high. Do that. Yeah, let's do that. So that was the advanced options there. V Sync. Let's turn off it and see if we have any tearing. If we do have tearing, then we'll turn on V Sync. Otherwise, it seems like everything's good to go. Let's go ahead and uh, start it up. Um. Whatever, let's do that. So I guess apparently it is a online game as well, uh, as far as uh, co-op. So I'm glad I actually got to work and didn't have to, you know, let you guys know on the first day of gameplay that you know shit don't work. And hopefully um, the the uh, balance of audio is good. As you see, I'm dropping to like 36 frames per second. It's definitely bouncing a lot. Let me move my cursor out of the way for you guys. As you can hear, definitely my uh, card is spinning up. This is 660 Ti. I don't really hear too much audio going on. Game looks alright so far, but supposedly they use a lot better textures inside of the cutscenes compared to in game. So this is basically the best it's going to get right here. Seventy-two out. Whoa! See, there you go. There you got some quality. And uh, yeah, so those are pretty good textures right there. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a treat and start after this uh, cutscene. So 30 minutes after the cutscene. So I'm gonna start the clock after this cutscene finishes from the official from the start of the gameplay. So we're doing 65, that's not bad, but I've heard that it's very, very unoptimized that uh, people have like, um, and I cannot hear anything. 
Hopefully you guys could hear. Wait, hold on. Let me turn up. Audio a little bit. So yeah, so a little bit late getting to uh, the start of this uh, day one. It's like almost one o'clock. Spending most of the time trying to get to maximize correctly. All right, so let's go ahead and turn up the audio. Just oh, I guess I can. So the uh, acceleration here is very, very. Um, very very extreme okay so there we go so let me go ahead and go into the audio uh, everything's on so I guess we're just gonna have to uh, deal with uh, the audio of the game and hopefully it mixes o okay shuffle so here we have quite a bit of inventory here the two by four Usually it's like right click to aim, yeah. It's broken air two by four out of it. Everything else looks pretty good. Oh yeah, I forgot to start. Okay, so now we're gonna start up to thirty minutes. chair, medical tray, I guess I'm full health now, the graphics aren't that bad and it seems like uh, we're pretty decent on the frame rate but we haven't really seen any zombies so far not very many zombies on screen also another thing is when you start this game you're not gonna get the uh, frame rate that I'm getting the reason why is I did a little um, there's a way to unlock it unlock the frame rate basically look it up you have to set an INI file and tell it to uh, set um, the unlock frames to true and go ahead and check that out because it seems to me like it's working because obviously it's telling me that it's working See, now I'm definitely dropping low, low frame rate because there's so many zombies. Okay, so I'm gonna take this guy, switch it with this guy. Back to my flashlight. Okay, 
Okay, so he's dead. Ooh, fire axe. That'll definitely help. Let's get rid of the shovel then for the fire axe. Chair, paint can. Overall, looking okay as far as the frame rate. Uh, machete, definitely gonna get a machete. So let's pick up this ration. Okay. There we go. Get a Bowie knife. I think we're going to avoid the Bowie knife. Wow, it takes quite a bit of... Hitting to kill these guys. Okay, so that was a strong attack. Meat cleaver. Let's get rid of the Bowie knife for that. Oh, we didn't grab a Bowie knife. So overall, very, very cool. Seems like... Okay, he's dead. Looking for like, uh, some sort of gun of some, some sort. Yeah, it didn't sound good. I think I killed him. Some coffee. Sledgehammer. So, of course, this uh, handgun is definitely no uh, Call of Duty for sure. Steel. I'm gonna stay with my fire nut and my crowbar. Dynamite. Who keeps dynamite? <laughs> Exhaust. 
I'll stay probably with the edged weapons or blunt weapon. Oh, that's a blunt weapon. Yeah, see, so definitely some frame drops here. Very good uh, textures in uh, cutscenes there, but, uh, you know, uh, not really worried too much about cutscenes when you have some good gameplay. Now we're jumping back up to 34. So yeah, so if you don't want to uh, deal with any of this stuff and you have not really uh, that good of hardware, then you might want to keep it locked at 30 frames per second. Sorry if you could hear my computer a lot. I'm going to try to uh, reposition my mic, see if I can get... Airplane. Wow, what a, what a pretty cool uh, freeze frame there. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and stop this uh, for a second and uh, let it go through and then we'll start the clock again. So like I said, I promised I was going to do it with uh, just gameplay. So we're probably going to be talking like 45 minute, 50 minute video. One of my longer videos, but uh, that's fine I guess. Yeah, because there's no skipping. Resuming now. Holy shit. We gotta get back to the others. Good thing I got guns, got axes, and got a freaking flashlight. You have to time your, your cues, otherwise it'll hit you. And I'm guessing that up there at the top left is your health. I'm gonna upgrade to a crowbar.
clearly broke that uh, whatever it's called, a crowbar. Oh man! Oh no way, I broke the crowbar. I'm running out of stuff to hit people with. Ooh, so yeah, I just let two people die there, unfortunately. Didn't realize that they were there. Oh jeez. Get through this, uh, this flurry of people here. Hopefully, I can find some friends because there's a lot of these guys that are freaking just. So basically a Q attack there basically kills anybody that gets in your way for the most part it seems like. A bunch of these guys freaking lying all over the place. So here we're doing 30 frames per second, I'm happy with that. As to me, it looks like this quality is really, really good. I don't really like the motion blur too much, but... Okay, so I see obviously what we gotta do. Sorry, that was my cat. Oh, that was definitely not good. I'm still alive. Whoa! Whoa! No! Give me one second, I'll be right back. Alright, so we are about 30 minutes in. Wow. So it says alt. I have no clue where I'm going. Let's do it anyways. Hopefully we are going the right way. Holy shit, I almost died. that soft drink so I'm just gonna kill everybody in here. Still alive buddy? Oh Jesus! No!
Yeah. So let's not go down there. Oh, no way. Okay, so let's try to save those guys that died. Let's try this again. Oh, there's Emily there. Come here, Dan. I got you, Dan. Okay, so they're basically gonna die no matter what. Okay, so the closer you get to them, they just die anyways, seems like. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. So it's gonna run to the part that I was at previously. Just so you guys can get some good gameplay, get off me. There's Duncan, Duncan's definitely dead. Let's just run through all these guys. Okay, successfully ran through. Oh my god, you gotta be joking. Alright, so I did get back to this uh, spot here. I just wanted to uh, um, pause it there so until I got to this part so I could uh, start again. I almost killed my uh, power drill. And get this 2x4. Okay, so I'm going to grab this power drill and we are still going on time here. Alright, so I found this uh, large wrench again. Hopefully it gives me type of damage. Ooh. Let's go with more blunt weapons, seems like they do a better job. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Serious frame drop. Serious frame drop. Good time for loading section as I'm dropping frames like crazy. Chip like responsible citizens, we might not be in this mess. 
Those people are tracked by GPS. They're prisoners. They're following the law. Those GPS chips have Zombrex in them. They keep infected people from turning zombie. Oh, really? Must not have worked well. Look outside. Ugh, you illegals are nothing but trouble. You know, why don't you calm down, down assholes? Oh, they're outside. We got nothing to worry about. Oh, no, screw, turn it off! Turn it off! Always the, a group of people that go out there. Jesus. Okay, everybody, get ready to run. I mean, where the hell are we gonna go? My garage in Ingleton. The walls are thick. It'll buy us some time to think. Maybe the TV will work. And if you get out of here, that's fine. But I'm not going any garage. People are waiting for me. Early? You better off with us. Take my chances. Nick, those zombies are gonna get in here any second. We gotta do something. There's nothing to fight them off with. You're good at fixing things. There's a lot of stuff around here. Let me see if I can put something together. All right, so now we get to the crafting part. Okay. Okay. Think, Nick. Think. Wow, I took all my items. by four yeah, let's get out of here
just clean through a couple of these zombies here. And then I guess we'll call it uh, Yeah, let's uh, call it good right here. So uh, this has been Steven from the Legit PC, and I think uh, th this is this is uh, day one of Dead Rising Three Apocalypse Edition. Very very cool game. Uh, not really as bad as I think people lead it to be. As you saw there, there was a lot of zombies, uh, but it still looks great. And this is 660 Ti and getting 40 frames per second to 30 frames per second. That's completely fine with me. But uh, like they said, I mean, it is unoptimized. I would like it to be up in 60, 70, but I mean, it's not the worst game I've ever seen. It's It's got decent textures, I think. But yeah, you definitely see the frame drop when you look up that way. But definitely look for uh, the INI fix for uh, to get 60 frames per second, up to 60 frames per second, if you want to do something like that. But people that have Titans, GTX, uh, NVIDIA Titans, can even get that type of uh, performance out of it even with those beastly cards so uh, yeah so um, go ahead and be waiting for my uh, review if you want to wait to get it otherwise go pick it up if you like what you see here and uh, play it from there uh, this is the only game I have out right now so I'm going to be definitely getting a review out quicker than if I'm pretty swamped on stuff all right, so uh, I'll be working on the review and getting that uh, within maybe a couple weeks. All right, so uh, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe for other videos like this one and other games as well. And I'll see you guys next video. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. Peace.